Hello, friends that I will never meet in person. A block here. With the Lost Vikings. So, we have braved jungles, volcanoes, ancient Egypt, um, factories, uh, wacky world, a candy world. And finally, we are in Tomator's spaceship, and it is time for our lost Viking friends to get home. <clears throat> Whoops. <laughs> um, so yeah, uh, I, I'm, I ended last week on the uh, second to last level of this entire game. And kind of got burned out before I could finish it, and so that's where we'll pick up today. And, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I mean, if I don't beat it tonight, then I'm going to have a lot of horrible luck because I, I pretty much got to the end last time, but I couldn't figure out how to get past a certain point. Um, but yeah, that's all covered. I just need to make it through that. And then there's the final level against, uh, Tomator himself. And that'll do it for this playthrough of the Lost Vikings. And then next week I'm going to start on the Lost Vikings 2, which will be a lot of fun. So, let's go forth to Tomator's Arena. Welcome to the Arena. Uh, survived longer than expected, but persistence alone will not save you now. Oh yes, it will, Tomator. All right, let's see, uh, let's see how many tries it'll take for us to get through this this week. <laughs> Ow, that's not great. Gosh, the attacks, okay, yeah, well, that's one try. Man, I hate those scorpions. All right, let's just get all these stupid deaths over with uh, in the beginning, yeah? Stop! Gosh, it's not fair. Stupid scorpions. Okay, here we go. Let's try and maintain them at, high, at uh, good levels of health here. Oh. Okay, apparently staying low helps pretty well in that case. Cool jump there. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, that's another tactic, I guess, to get past them, is just, like, let them sort of flip around. Alright, that is off. Ooh. Oh gosh, oh gosh, too low. Too low! So ironic when I die trying to get health items. It's okay. The muscle memory should, you know, start kicking in soon. Ah! Anyway, I'm glad I have so much mobility when I'm floating in midair like this. <laughs> Ah, ah. Yep. Okay, come on. No! Oh. I freaking hate scorpions. Here I was thinking how funny it would be if I beat it on the first try. Okay, I think I figured out the pattern. If I rush them as soon as he shoots the first little bullet thingy, whatever those are, little poison balls, then I think it works pretty well. Oh boy. 
way. Yeah, just stupid scorpion. Oh, you know what I just realized? I all these years I thought that that claw right there was its beak, but that's its claw. <laughs> that is so funny. My entire childhood up until this very moment, I thought that that was like its mouth, like a beak. Oh gosh! Oh gosh! Okay, there we go. I got it at least when I was looking for here. Okay. Full health. And you know what? I, I really do want this. Uh, oh, crap, crap. <sighs> Once again, the irony hits. I'm just gonna try and get the shield. <sighs> but I was an idiot for... Got too greedy. <clears throat> I'll still get it, I just it's kind of a waste because Eric lost a hit point trying to get it. Alright. All in all, that this first area is really just kind of a nuisance. It's really not that hard at all. Anything over there? Oh, finally I killed one of them. All right, not so fast, blah, blah, blah. We will not escape, yes we will. We can get past all three of these trials. Okay, I just gotta be, just gotta be careful. Um, who keeps dying? It's probably, let's give it to Baliog, I think, because, like, I think that first one was dangerous for Eric, and then this one, and then the rest is kind of dangerous for Baliog. Oh my gosh, okay. Yeah, let's, I think I have to wait for all of them to get here together first, so that... Oof. Let me down, Olaf. Let me down. Okay, here we go. stays within the screen so that <laughs> Eric wasn't in any real danger. Whew. Okay, next segment. Same as the first here. Go for it, Baliog. This one's even better. He's got a little lip of wall right there that he can't get past, so that's good. with hit points here. Ready to go. No, 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 no! Oh, vicious. So glad I used that shield. Okay, guys, you're good. Feel free to come over. And, uh, I think I'm gonna need that radish. Alright, let's see if I can kill. 
kill this. Oh, I can't kill it with a bow, huh? Um. I think it'd be best to just rush past it. Oh no, not good. Not good. <sighs> Man. I can't remember how I got past that part last time. Oh well, we got plenty of time. Just two levels left is all. Yeah, look at that. It's getting better at, uh, <coughs> at dodging there. Alright, let's, uh... I'm definitely gonna, like, hoard all the vegetables I can find. Flawless so far. Oh, shoot. That's not good. Oh, okay, we're fine. Thank goodness for those little edges of the uh, electrical fields. Oh my gosh! I gotta just shut up, huh? Because <laughs> perfect run, and then he just gets right on the edge of that electrical field. Back where we start, we've been given another chance. One monster fight, more chance to find. No, no, no. Okay, I'm hoping I can get this first part up to it. Nope. Science. Just want the tomato. Thank you. Okay, now we're jumping too fast, Eric. None of that. Still at full health, so that's a bonus. Thing kind of fun about uh, 
like the fact that their <coughs> their falling animation is used for the uh, the anti gravity floating animation because oh that was close because um, it's funny that their hair gets kind of you know like lifted up. Haha, <laughs> you're not getting in here this time. <sighs> Alright, it's okay if Olaf gets hurt. Is it tank? In fact, I feel like Olaf has only gotten hurt, like... I don't think he's ever been below two hit points in this entire playthrough, which is kind of funny. Oh, shoot. Okay. Okay. Any more? Ho ho I like that. And all I did was lose my shield point. Not bad. Okay. Uh, I wish I could use my sword in the air. That'd be nice. Um... I wonder if we should just run past this one. Is that what I did last time? I gotta do it with one, I gotta do it with all. Might as well try it. Okay, so yeah run to safety, so I'll just let Eric handle that. got to the end, I think, on my first try, but I couldn't get past that one part, so. So if I'm just careful, I think I can do this. Alright, basic practice, go Olaf first. Oh, yep. Oh, I suddenly realize why Tomator has these random creatures on his ship. It's because, like he said, he's like an evil villain. What did he say? Like Zookeeper or something? Not Zookeeper, but like... Prisoners. Something about prisoners, so... Hey, hey! Okay. And Eric? Yeah, 
that's the problem with Eric is he's super swift per his name, but he also has really sort of uh, unstable controls sometimes. Oh, but okay. So I need the blue key. Where did I get the blue key again? Oh, just up there. Okay. Is there lightnings? There's not. Oh yeah, I remember talking about that last time. How it's kind of like a little bit easier right there. But it could have made shocky things up there. Okay, so I think that we keep going forward. Nothing over there, right? Okay. Is there like a secret area over here? Nope. Okay, so we're just gonna go forward through the teleporter. Um, go first with Olaf, just to make sure the coast is clear. Oh! Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we're almost done, you guys. We got this. Okay, so this is where I got stuck last time, and it's actually really quite simple. And the hint is right there all along, see? So I'm obviously on a ladder right here. So, if I go over here... Yeah, there's another ladder right there. <laughs> that was the answer to the puzzle all along. And I think we're almost done already, so... <laughs> sort of unforgiving, you know, long segmented journey that we're on right now it reminds me of uh, King Dice on Cuphead. That was, that was a grueling fight as well. <clears throat> okay, this is it. So I, I really hope that I don't like... I'm so, I'm so scared of being shocked. Ooh, okay. Easy as pie. We got this. We got this. Here, Olaf. Have some meat. You deserve it. Okay. I think that's it. Shh, quick. Let's hurry out the exit before he finds us. Oh! Done. All right. And for the finale, it's going to be a very... Sh uh, <laughs> it's going to be a very short stream indeed, but that's okay. I'm a little tired today anyway, so I don't think I could go for too many hours. So, this is Tomator. I ask you, would this not be an amazing Heroes of the Storm character? It bugs me to no end that he is not on Heroes of the Storm. He's very unique looking, he's interesting, <laughs> um, and he's, as you'll see, he's got some attacks that would be very fun to work into a, ga a, a game like that. So I really hope they add Tomator someday, but anyway, we'll see. Password is master. Okay, here we go. Grr, the three of you have been a constant headache ever since I brought you aboard. Does that mean we can go home now? Uh, okay. Not! Now this is an alien I can't wait to bash! Well, I'd love to chat, but I've got mean and evil things to do. Have fun! <laughs> okay. I vaguely remember this level, I just remember it's a lot of fun, so let's go do this. Bombs are a very important part of this level. Oh! Oh! Oh, ouch. Okay. Oh, poor Olaf. Okay, well, that's okay, because we don't have to start over and spend 10 minutes getting to this point all over again. I hope he doesn't monologue every single time, though. Okay, have fun. Ha ha ha. Yeah, yeah. I like that. Okay, so we know he's in the next room. Okay, I love this. This is such a fun way to do a boss battle on this game, because all three of the Vikings get to use their abilities against Tomator. Oh, 
Ow. Oh, shoot. Oh. Okay. So that was that. I didn't quite, I didn't actually see, but he might have gotten shocked at the bottom a little bit before he disappeared, I can't remember. Oh, a, uh, a little refreshment area, I'll take it. Um, did that disable something up here? Because not. Okay, it did. Um, okay, well, they probably both have to go down here, so. Hey. No, no, okay. All right, you got me there. All right, well, let's do a little bit of reconnaissance here. Okay, so you fall down. This is, no, nope, no secret area as much as it looks like it. Got to kind of dart out and use that key right before you fall. Flaming arrow for Baliog, very good. Ooh, a moving uh, lightning thing, huh? Interesting. All right. Oh, <laughs> you can still control the elevator. All right, this is fine. This is fun. I like this. Nothing tricky or, you know. Um, contrived or anything. It's just just takes a few uh, just takes a few tries here. We got this. Let's see if I can get this all done in one shot with these bombs. I, I can do it. Sir, you're supposed to. You're sp what is happening? Oh, did he glitch? <laughs> I glitched it. I did it too fast. That's hilarious. Yeah, he wasn't supposed to fall that quickly. And so he didn't drop the key and he didn't disappear, so. <sighs> well, excuse me for being too good at this game. I'm surprised that that, uh, that bug didn't get caught in this game. That's kind of funny. No one tried to do that in QA. Oh, I'm sure some speedrunner has uh, discovered that before. Ow! Bad. Bad. Oh! I wanted so bad to catch one of those bombs on my shield just to feel cool, but I ended up shoot, catching a bullet in the back, too. Have fun, Mr. Tomato? Oh, I have. I've had very much fun in this game. Thank you. Another thing that would be good on Heroes of the Storm... Oh, gosh. Is, um... The, uh, like, one of these worlds as, like, an arena. Like, how cool would, like, a candy world be, you know? And here he is, you know, shooting lasers. Ouch! Throwing bombs. That's already given some good ideas for him as a character, you know, abilities and whatnot.
that's for. Oh. Like, there's clearly a... Oh, crap. <sighs> Famous last words. I wonder what this button does. It's okay. Now we got time to experiment. It's a Saturday night. What else am I going to do? But figure out fun ways to die on the last level. Of Ouch! You know what? That is burned into my mind right there. That uh, that getting shot in the side, getting hit by a bomb like that. It's just. It's. I, I remember trying so many times as a kid and getting that same. Ah ah! Oh, so close. Oh. Poor Olaf. I wonder if I try too many times if he'll say something else besides uh, have fun because you know the Vikings have said before like oh does this place look familiar or whatever ha what do you think of that oh gosh Okay, yeah, that part is kind of tricky, I'll admit. Nope, just gotta keep taunting me with that body. slot there, but that doesn't mean that I needed to, like, shoot out of it, because I think that's just for a way for me to, like, get back, you know, so. Oh, shoot, is there a spring over there? Oh my gosh, it's timed! That's the problem. Oh, it's timed. Okay, so I just wasted too much time, and then it turned back on. Okay, so that's what the slit's for. You have to shoot through there, push the button, and then hurry back so that it doesn't shock you. Okay. Now we know, and knowing is half the battle. Ah. Crap. I'm trying to... Does he have a... I think he has a pattern where it's three bombs, or no, two bombs and three lasers, maybe? One, two... gamer who streams on YouTube. This is... It's embarrassing. I'm surprised you are watching this right now, because I wouldn't watch me. 
After the seventh try on this level, I'd be like, okay, this guy sucks. That time I think it worked. Let's find out. Nope. <sighs> okay, can't can't get ahead of myself here. Yeah, you're right, Maledict. Um <laughs> the the difficulty curve on these levels I feel like was not very smooth. The tutorial levels, you know, obviously easy. The jungle world, you know, simple. Uh, Egypt, pretty easy. Um, mechanical world, that's when at least, you know, they, they got some like. Oh, 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 it landed on it. Barely made it there. Um, wacky world, super hard. And this, you know, extremely hard as well. Oh my gosh, I almost died again. But I didn't. Okay. Down there. Nope, no, 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 get away from the... It's gonna turn back on. Okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, alright. I see where that goes now. Alright, tomato. Okay, I'm guessing I shoot both of those. And then he just falls, right? I think that's it. So it's just kind of a balancing act between dodging his lasers. One, two, three, four. Oh! Oh, oh, okay, that wasn't even fair. Laser bomb zap. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's going to be rough, but we'll give it a try. At least the first part won't get... Uh, at least I'm getting better at the first part, more or less. Oh, did you see that? Oh, he's throwing like three bombs at a time now. What the heck, man? Ah! Oh! -ho 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 -ho. That was close. I don't know what this other bomb is for, but... I always grab it every time, just in case. Okay, man. Alright, let's try this again. This time, let's go farther away on the side of the elevator here, and here we go. Oh, not good, not good. Oh. Man, this is rough. It's just such a, it's such tight quarters. I mean, if even if it was just a little block that was blocking those uh, levers, it would be fine. But it's a little electrical field. Like that's not even fair. Stop! You cheat, sir. Oh, I got too close to him. I'll try again. Have fun! Ha ha ha! I'm surprised he doesn't like taunt me. Like he, you know, I, I feel like that'd be a good chance for him to be like, 
Uh, what's the matter? Can't, you know. rate on the first and second ones are pretty bad, but that third one I usually get, so. I feel like I did better on that practice round when Eric died than I did on this one. I guess I have this uh, radish that I can use if I get hit, but the, the, I guess the main problem has been just getting immediately shocked, though. It isn't even about the hit points. It's just uh, stupid bombs and lasers. That just... Okay, he shoots four lasers and then a bomb. I think. Why did he stop? One, two, three, four, bomb. One, two, three, four, bomb. And then he takes a break. Ha! Ha ha! You exposed your pattern, good sir. <laughs> okay, I'm guessing Eric has to get that key, right? Yeah, no way Baliog's gonna get it. Okay. I will leave the elevator for him then. Ugh. I didn't even get hit that time. Yeah, he exposed his, uh, exposed his pattern. Oh, okay, I got it, I got it. He's supposed to stay there for Eric's well-being, so that Eric can get past. I gotcha. Working together here, I like it. Okay, Baliog, if you would mind. Wait a minute. What is happening here? How, how can Eric even get it? <laughs> Did I do something wrong? Did I did I kill Tomator in a bad way or something? Oh, I got it. Okay. That's weird. Like I, I feel like that's I feel like that's really hard. I wonder how many people um had to like look up the you know walkthrough or whatever after that part. Okay. All right. Let her rip, Baliog. Okay. Here we go. Oh. Is that just a floor, I hope? Oh, okay, we're fine, we're fine. Might as well use the shield, why not? Oh! It's gotta be a leap of faith, I guess. Oh, they, they probably did that on purpose. Oh, they didn't want you chickening out. You had to just go for it and hope you push the button right, or... You die. Making progress. I will be somewhat embarrassed if, uh. Ooh. Ow, my foot. I will be somewhat embarrassed if this stream is just as long as the other streams. <laughs> and it's only two levels instead of, like, entire worlds. Good day to you, sir. 
Oh, I bet that bomb's just a backup bomb in case you mess up your first time. Again. Last these horribly uh, electrifying. Come on, this is just brutally hard. Ah. Duh. Okay, thank you, Ricardo. I'm I'm an idiot. Yeah, I. Here I am trying to do it the hard way, and the levers just move the stupid thing back. <laughs> okay, thank you. <laughs> oh man, I'm bad at this. All right. Well, that'll that that next part is the bag. Then. Oh no. But I, I think I've been an idiot, like, all these years, because I, I think I remember as a kid just trying to make that stupid jump instead of just flipping the levers again, so... So funny. Okay. It can be way easier at this point. Oh. <sighs> you know, at least I uh, at least I provide a realistic gamer experience, right? I'm not some like crazy guy who can do all of this in one go. I'm like I'm like uh, you know. Let's see if I can do two bombs at least. Ow. Okay. Alright. Well, we just figured out a way to uh, make the make that run a little bit faster. Shoving my face into that. Uh, there we go. So much better. 
better. In fact, yeah, Eric doesn't even need to come here. I'm an idiot. Okay, that saves me a lot of time. Ugh. Thank, thank goodness, uh... Thank goodness Ricardo pointed that out. Okay, yeah, this is a, this is what I thought it was before. Like, this is all about Balyog just getting himself back. It's not... Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, the, there's gonna be... We're on for it, matey. Okay. Here we go. I hate these circular moving platforms. Like, it freaks me out every time. <laughs> okay, I, I, uh, now it's Eric's turn to shine. Crap, is there any lightning on the way down, or can I just fall all the way? I really hope I don't. Okay, we're good. Okay, now it's Eric's turn to do his step of the journey. His is the most fun, if I remember correctly. Okay. First of all, Balyog. I mean, that uh, shield and, uh, and that radish. And all this meat, because I'm probably going to need it. You know what? Is there anything here? Ah, uh, where's, where's all the stakes that were at the first of the... Wish me luck, guys. Here I go. Oh, oh, he's right there. Not good. Okay, dodge. Stuff like this where I wish I could, like, just do that last part first, you know, because I'm getting so tired of doing this Olaf part. But... Oh, okay, that, that was not good. Thank goodness for this uh, spare bomb here. Oh, come on. That should have been...
Geronimo. I like how this spaceship is blue, you know? Like most spaceships are gray or whatever. Because on an emulator, you can just push a button to rewind, and so I would just do that whenever I would make the slightest mistake. But, you know, in this one, it costs you starting over, so. So, uh, you guys got any questions for me? Since you're probably just going to keep watching the same thing over and over again. Like that. Oh, I'm trying to find a shortcut. There's got to be a pattern to his. The other ones had patterns, I think, right? I gotta figure out that one. I guess I just need to be patient with his uh, bombs, because whenever he shoots two like that, that means he's gonna... Oh! Down you go. 
Oh, slipped. Slipped again, man. Must not be the right approach. Okay. My D and D game. Yeah, let's talk about that. So, I have a D and D game running so far. Uh, currently, every Wednesday we play it. Uh, and uh, I'm currently the DM of it, which is really fun. Uh, we've been playing for like two years at this point. And you can watch our games uh, on a YouTube channel called DM Quest, which I should really make a featured channel of, of Ablehawk because it'd be easier to link to it or whatever. It's uh, a lot of fun. <clears throat> uh, one of the players is my childhood best friend. We've been playing games together for a long time, so that's really fun. And then the other guys are just guys that we found online, and we're all DMs, so we take turns uh, being DM in the same world. And, uh... Take turns having player characters as well, so it's really fun because the world sort of gets shaped uh, with each, you know, with each person. So 
so I, I wonder if there's just something I'm missing, because bashing him seems to be... I, I don't even know if that does damage to him, you know? Like, there's a key I need. Uh, well, maybe he drops the key if I bash him three times. I guess that's possible. I'll try that again, I guess, but I just have to be a lot more careful. Yeah, he made like a pained face, you know. Um laser. Ow. No. Um, um laser. Laser. Oh, I see what you mean. Bash him like that. That's actually a good idea. I'll do that next time, because, yeah, the, the, oops, the problem last time has been being too, you know, close with it, so, okay, yeah, now I remember, now I remember, bash him, no, no, I ate my food as fast as I could, but he just devoured me too quickly, all right, well, now we know what to do, so he gets zapped when he bash him into the field. Okay, now I, I remember that, too. It's just, it's so funny how uh, how, like, little things stand out. Like, I know at some point after that, Balyog is gonna have to use his um, fire arrows to disable that little shield he summons, and then Okay, he's gotta have a pattern here. Laser, laser, laser. Bomb. Laser, 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 bomb, bomb, laser, laser, bomb, bomb, laser, laser, bomb, bomb. Okay, yeah, now I've discovered his pattern here, so that shouldn't be a problem either. Aha! I just needed to uh, pay more closer attention to that, but now we know his pattern, so that's not bad. Okay, so in the future, I'm gonna bash, I'm gonna bash Tomator into the field, and then immediately just jump up onto that ladder. who has joined since I began. Uh, what you're seeing now is basically what I've been doing for the past, like, <laughs> 40 minutes, so eventually I'll get this speed. But yeah, this last level is... Bomb, laser, laser, laser. Bomb. Yay! 
yeah, <laughs> somebody is. Uh, you're mentioning Tomator's uh, design of his ship. Oh, you're absolutely right. Like, I mean, look at all these exposed wires. I mean, this is this is violating all kinds of regulations for construction here. Okay, I need to get better using that spring because that saves me a little bit of time. I haven't died on yet. Like that thing I seem to do pretty well at, so that's good. Right? Oh, this part stresses the crap out of me though. Whew. Alright. Come on down, Eric. This is the time, okay? We just gotta be more careful this time with the uh careful with, uh, with just not getting, jumping right into Tomato's face, because that's what killed me this time, so. Alright, here we go. So, good question, Sly88 Fry. Um, yeah, you started out in the spaceship at the first of the game, and then you escape into like various worlds and then you come back here to the spaceship to beat the end boss so that's where i am right now uh so yeah it is the same area as uh the first of the game but yeah this time it's to uh defeat tomator which is this guy who's been in, who's the one who abducted us in the first place such a problem with this whole game. Oh, wow, patterns. Alright, bomb. Bomb. Laser. Laser. Bash. Zap. There we go. Okay. This, this is really easy. You just go. There we go. Alright. Okay, are we good? Are we good? What's going on next? Alright, we've got a take gravity field, which means we're going to have to do some jumps and whatnot. Should go first. I guess Olaf's always the best one to go first. Whew, okay, here we go. Okay, no problems at all with that. That's basically just for the uh, sake of Balliog because. I'll just do it with Eric too, though, because I always tend to overcorrect with him. Okay, here we go. Go ahead first, Olaf, and let us know what we're doing here. Okay, we're almost done here. Okay. 
Okay, we got a bomb. And I'm using a bomb here. Uh, okay, here we go. Alright, so, um... Okay, I know we gotta go down there, but then what? I guess we'll go with Ola first. Okay, so we basically just need to... Um, oh, thank goodness there aren't any... <laughs> Electrical fields here. It's like refreshing for change. Okay, so let's just go down there. Uh, is he gonna shoot me? Anything? No? Okay. Okay, I know that I need to use my fire arrows to um, disable his shield. We need to use this bomb to blow up his, uh, his, uh, that thing under him, and then we use... Okay, so here's what I think we need to do. Uh, I think Eric needs to go up and around and blow up that platform under him. He falls onto the ground, Olaf blocks his shield with, from his lasers, Baliok disables his shield with the fire arrows, and then Eric bashes him into that L, that uh, anti-gravity thing to uh, basically knock him out of the ship, so. Yeah, okay, so. Oh gosh. Guys, move up. Oh no. Oh. Oh, guys. Oh, okay. We did it. We did it. Um, I think we're supposed to follow him out. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, do we bomb the computer now? Oh, no. He's back. Okay. we do bomb the computer. I have an extra bomb, but that can't be possibly what it's for, is it? Okay, okay. We got a chance to regroup here. Okay, so meet. Uh, okay, we're all, everybody else is at full health, though. We got this. <sighs> oh, I, I really, really enjoy, um, I mean, this is, what a game, you know? Like, there's three Vikings. They have very specific abilities. It, it must have taken, I mean, it, it takes a lot of it's very interesting that they um, were able to come up with this uh, way to defeat the boss by using all three of the Vikings' abilities. It's really, really amazing. Okay, so here we go. That I always die right before the game ends. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna take a break after that many times getting so close to the end. I just need to take a breather. So, I'll be back in a few, and uh, then we'll, uh, we'll defeat Tomator once and for all. We got all the patterns down. We just got to muscle through that first part and then just be more careful on that second part. So I'll be back in a few.
Uh, somebody already mentioned this, answered this question, but yes, uh, two Lost Vikings games came out in the 90s. Um, I can't believe I actually worked out. That time I got it. Yeah, the second one is just like a direct sequel, same characters, slightly different abilities, and uh, a couple of new characters, which are pretty fun. So yeah, I will be playing that uh, next week. of that uh, last fight because like you know I only have a couple seconds to get past that shield with the fire arrow and it's really frustrating. And 
out of here. Alright. Send it on through there, Balyog. the um need the bombs. Uh right, here you go, Olaf. You're looking a little hungry. Um I'll give that to Olaf as well. Give, uh, to here you go, Olaf oh, Eric. Okay. You ready guys? Okay. That's not good. Oh no. Okay. Good range here. Is he gonna put up a field? Okay. Oh no, Olaf, no! Oh. Field. Oh. <sighs> okay, so yeah, I, I will use this time as I die to answer questions. So yes, so this came out in like 1992. They weren't even called Blizzard at the time. They were called Silicon and Synapse, and uh, they became Blizzard later on. I have no idea who was on the team at the time. I mean, these, uh, these art styles and stuff look like Samwise Didier, but I don't, I kind of don't think that that's what they are. I mean, it's just, I think it's just the bright colors and stuff. So. I'd, I'd really be interested, actually, in looking at the credits. I hope that they, uh, that they scroll when this game is done. Because I'd like, I wonder if, like, like who actually founded Blizzard? Was it, like, Mike Morgan? Benson? Or any of Warcraft's creators on here? I don't know. But yes, it was, uh, Lost Vikings was referenced on World of Warcraft with the Lost Dwarves. and it didn't turn on, so that's a good sign.
satisfying to <laughs> see him get shocked in the back like that. Oh no! Not good, not good, not good! Ooh. Just those stupid, um, those stupid, uh, electrical fields because it's just a one hit kill. It's so annoying. Does Eric really need all those? Because, I mean, all this food is great, but like, it's, it's of no use, like. thing that I... This is so frustrating. Um, the thing that... Uh, the thing that I like about Lost Vikings 2 is um, Eric's dashing ability works a little bit differently, and it's easier to tell when he's bashing, because that's why I kept dying, is... I couldn't tell if he was bashing or not, and that, that time, you know, I just <laughs> basically, um, you know, just ran right into him. Wow, I'm surprised I didn't die from that.
found is just not knowing when uh, Eric is using his bash ability. Because he doesn't change speed, which is kind of funny. Like he's just running and then he... See, that's another thing, like, is it Glenn Stafford? I don't know. Hey, look at this! We all got shields now. That's gotta be a first on this game. I, maybe that's a good, maybe it's a good sign. I don't want to read into it, of course, but... be afraid of his, like, bombs and stuff as much. Uh, it's a real shame that I have to bash him like this, because... Like, I think his shield goes off at certain points, but I'm too scared to, d to run into him and, you know, risk just instantly dying if it pops up. It's really unfair. Okay. For freedom! Okay. Okay, we got this. We gotta... We gotta do this. Oh, and it doesn't even have an electric fence at the top. Oh, awesome. Okay. Alright. Wish me luck, guys. This is... It all comes down to this. Um, I just gotta be smart. Just gotta not... Uh, dash into his shield, can't get too close to it, and then we'll eject him from the ship, that's all we gotta do, so. Alright, man, nobody lives forever! Shoot, okay, okay. This is it, you guys. I got this. Pull the lever, Gronk. Wrong lever! Oh, yes. 
has. Finally. Phew, that was close. Now let's jump in that time door and get the heck out of here. Wait, I think I can fly this ship. No way, Olaf. You can barely fly your shield. Trust me. I'll just turn this knob. Flip this switch. And press this button. Self-destruct sequence has been initiated. <laughs> it's interesting that it says in a red text, because that's usually Eric's, but I would have thought it would have been blue, but well. Five seconds till self-destruct. Guys, I think we should take the time to work. <laughs> Good idea. Let's go. I've only heard this music a handful of times, so... We down they go. looks familiar. They've returned. Hooray! Yay! Da 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 da! It's kind of funny that their spouses have uh, the same coloring as them. Been to many strange and exciting places, but nowhere so wonderful as home. Look what we brought back from the future. guitars. Ooh, and the, now this, is there going to be credits with uh, them playing basically the opening music? Yeah, yeah. All of some of the drums, isn't it? Yep. Alright. Here we go. I'm going to watch all these credits. I really appreciate the makers of this game. Such a good game. Hey, this is exactly like the credits for uh, Warcraft 3, isn't it? You know, it's, it's like showing all the creatures from the game. Brian Fargo. Nobody I recognize so far, but... Michael Morhaim. Okay, so he was on the original team. That makes sense. Patrick Wyatt, Jim Sproul, Michael Strage, John Philip Britt. I don't recognize them. Oh, and that robot is holding a gun. Oh, Samwise Didier was on artwork. Okay, I take it back. Anyway, that robot was holding a gun. I always thought it's face was a cannon. It's so funny that you don't notice these things unless you look close. Anyway, that's awesome. I didn't know that Samwise Didier worked on this. I thought he joined the team. Um, okay, Charles Deenan did the music, so... Anyway, 
I, I thought I remembered Samwise did a uh, joint for Warcraft 1, but I guess it was during this period, so it looks a lot like his work. Scott Campbell. Oh, I'm thinking of Tom Campbell, so... Ah oh, yes, who could forget Nega Baliog? Watch for the Lost Vikings too. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was a blast to play. Sorry I sucked so bad. Um but it was it was a lot of fun even though I got stuck on a couple of levels. And yeah, we will um, we'll pick up next week with uh, Lost Vikings 2, and uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. Um, from what I can remember, the puzzles aren't quite as difficult, but with five characters instead of three, well, there's only three at a time, but they uh, there's a lot more different types of puzzles and stuff, so it's a lot of fun. Anyway, I encourage you guys to play this game if you get a chance. Uh, it's a lot of fun. It's a really good, like, puzzle game for kids, I'd say. Um, I remember I enjoyed it quite a bit when I was around eight or nine years old, but... Ah, oh, yeah, but it was great. It was really great to revisit the game, and uh, a lot of fun, so... Alright, this music's probably just going to keep going, so... Alright, thanks guys for joining me, and uh, look forward to some more videos coming out in the future. I've been in a really hot project lately, which has been really great for progress on videos for the channel, so... You can uh, look forward to more in the future, so... Okay, I will talk to you guys later, and uh, 